Good afternoon. It's almost four o'clock in the afternoon. I've been out here all day and it's been raining half the day. But anyway, this is as far as I've gotten. This is my debris pile. Oh yeah, the debris pile. Let's go look at the damage. Oh, it's beautiful now. This morning it rained for an hour, I mean heavy. And then around one o'clock it rained again. So I'm packing up. I've already done all my damage I'm gonna do. Good God, man. And the humidity, oh God. The humidity is through the roof right now. But here we are. And let me tell you something. I got out of here at 9.30 because I had to go to the bank this morning. Because you know yesterday was a holiday. And this was not easy. It was not easy at all. Especially up around that porch and stuff, man. That was that was a bitch. And let me tell you, trying to get all these boards, and they were all tucked underneath that uh, hardy plank. Oh, this is masonite, actually. But it wasn't that easy either. Try not to tear the damn thing up. And, of course, we know our post is sitting right there on top of the stoop, right on the header plate. And uh, I'm not going to try to move, obviously, this. So I already informed the homeowner that I just cut a little block around it and left it alone. All right, here we go. This is what's going on. Oh, let me not fall and bust my ass. Oh yeah, I, let, I lost my tool down there, man. See it? Here it is, right there. <laughs> my crowbar, but I'm not getting down there. Oh no, <laughs> I'm too big to be squeezing down in that, in that hole. That's about five foot deep. Now nah, I'll figure out how to get it out of there. But anyway. All right. Remember, these were this whole thing is was out of code completely. That was the distance between the joists. That's where the big sinking was. The whole deck was sinking right in here, big time. It was sinking right there, and it was sinking over here. So I put this little brace here. As you can see, I'm walking right on the edge, man. Put a brace. And there, sandwiched it. This was the worst one. It had rot in there. But you just sandwich them. You just put them in there, man. That's all you need to do. Just sandwich them. Because remember, this this house is God 30 years old, and the rest of them, the rest of these are fine. But I'll probably stick another one in here, probably. But I'm not sure yet. But so far, this is pretty strong. This is a lot better than what it was. And I've already got my boards running. There we go. Cool. And this, this distance right here, this is a true 18 feet. 18 feet, half inch. So, and they messed up here too. This thing bows in. They got the, the two posts that are in here are off. They're completely off. There's a big bow up in here. I'll show it to you. You can see it. See the bow? So they totally misread and miscalculated both these posts. Now I'm going to do some cross bracing. Let me get back over here so I don't kill myself. Okay, what I'm going to do is I can't, I can't demo this thing and, 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 and fix it. Let's just put it this way. It's not in the money at all. Uh, it, it, it's not a problem. I'm just going to cross brace in here, cross brace in here, and then get that part of at least up the code. There's not a whole lot I can do, like I said, to, to just demo the whole thing is just not in the money. So you can see, when you look down at halfway, it bows out because this corner post should be about, in fact, this is perfect. This corner post should be right here, right here. See how far they got it off? How stupid. Right there, there's our, 
unevenness. But again, I'm not going to do anything about it. That's not, that's not part of the program. The deck's been holding up for 30 years like this. All I'm doing is replacing the skin. And I'm going to put pickets in between here just to get that big gap out of there so we don't have to tear this whole handrail and lattice system up. I mean, a, a picket system off. And then I'm going to paint it white. That's right. Th this is all going to be white. And then I'm going to stain the deck a different color. Okay. This is day one. This has actually got a small little little basement down there all right day one let me know what you think like i said that was a pain in the ass but i got it all right tom out of here